Good morning, it's Rosalie with Can't Wait to Plan. How are you guys doing? Okay, so um, I'm finally ready to do my the second part of my Brutus Monroe um, <clears throat> haul as well as some collective haul that uh, I got from Crafts Direct and Joanne. And this is more of my sort of doodle bug um, haul. And it's, it, it's sort of my strategy on how I can start collecting some older collections of older and current collections of Doodlebug. I started to fall in love with it, um, with Doodlebugs just a few months ago. And I'm like going nuts so <laughs> about trying to get all of the collections. And I don't necessarily need to get everything complete. I just sort of pick and choose what I like. Um and so forth because I know I can get collections and things but I also don't want to get them at uh, retail and I want to get a good price for it and as you know doodlebug don't discount very much or doodlebug products don't get discount very much by retailers so I took the opportunity that Brutus Monroe was doing a 25% off a bunch of their stuff, including all of their doodle bugs. And so I went nuts on the doodle pops. I got doodle pops a while back, one box of the mystery doodle bugs for 20 of them for $25 or something like that, um, which is really good price. I got that from Joanne and I even got it at with a 50% off coupon. So I think my doodle pop with that mystery box was like, I don't know, 75 cents, 70, 60 cents each or something like that. But um, they're not that price normally. Um, this is what I came up with for, you know, as you know too, Joanne tend to sometime up um, up their list price so that when, when you get the discount, then it's, it's it seems better. So I always make sure that I checked um, a couple of larger retail like scrapbook.com and cherry on top and stuff like that and put together my my list price of the manufacturer that I like um, and so forth so I know how to um, compare the pricing once it's discounted so if you um, <clears throat> I would recommend that you do something like this if you want a copy of this feel free to connect with me and I can email to you but um it's really really helpful and I try to alphabetize as much as I can and also kind of group them together so it's easy for me to take a look whenever I see something on sales yeah so anyway so this a lot of it I'll tell you where I got things and how much things are but um for the most part this is um this is from Brutus Monroe so anyway I got these paper from Pumpkin Spice which I really really like um from um, some you know a sales before so I didn't get this this time and it was a really good price I think it was half off so it was like 50 cents each and um, so I took the opportunity to pick up some shape sprinkle which you know are kind of like their what they call their um, puffy stickers and they tend to be much smaller um, this is the happy fall and the big me happy um, from that from that uh, collection pumpkin spice and their um sprinkle shape sprinkle is five dollars normally so i got this for 325 i also got all, all the doodle pops i can find from the collection from here and normally they're two dollars i got it for a dollar fifty so it's not too bad but i just love these i mean they're so cute with the faces and all these um cute little creatures and donuts and things like that so i got that and then from craft directs um about a month ago maybe three weeks they had a bunch of their um um what do you call it um uh six by six paper pad on sales and doodle bugs normally price at seven dollars they had it on sale for four dollars so i picked up some of the collection that i liked and these are double-sided so i'm going to try to flip this for you i don't have the main 12 by 12 doodle bugs pumpkin spice yet so um this is it but i i do like to pick up um the six by six as well so that i can use it for photo matting or maybe to focus on certain things um, on my scrapbook layout or maybe even to make 
a coordinating card or an envelope pockets or something like that. So I went ahead and picked this up and I thought for $4 and compared to $7, that was a good price. And these you get um, 12 design, 24 sheets. So you get two of each design. And look how cute these are. I mean, yeah, you get the same thing if you, when you get the larger collection, but they're much larger. So sometimes you could use these type of things for embellishment. And I think now it repeats or not. Let me see. Uh, not quite yet. Look how cute these coffee cups are. Yep, there you go. Okay, so now it repeats. So that was the 6x6 six six, uh, paper pack. So anyway, I also got this a while back. I think it was from um, scrapbook.com when they had their big um, Christmas in July sales. I don't even remember how much it was, but I knew I had the Christmas town and a little bit of the Christmas magic. So I took, um, and they're very, you know, doodlebug as many of the smarter manufacturer realized that they should make their collection similar in color so you can mix and match um, and so forth. So I love that. And um, Doodlebug does that the same. So this is all of the Doodle Pops and the Shape Sprinkle I was able to get from um, the Christmas Town collection. I mean, oh my God, they're so, so cute. Look at these snowmen. Yep. Okay. And then I also got some... Um, um, this is the collection hit called Hippity Hoppity. Um, I got a few pieces of paper from them with, you know, Brutus Monroe didn't have like the whole thing. These are just leftover of things when this was introduced because I think this collection was introduced either last year or this year in uh, Easter time. So these are their cute, cute uh, shape sprinkle as well as doodle pops. Again, these were $150 versus $2 and these were $350 versus um, $375 versus $5. So these are the paper I picked up from the Hippity Hoppity collection. Super cute. Look at these cute flowers. And you see how similar their collection colors are? So it's not going to be too difficult to do stuff. And this I got before from um, their, I picked it up from Joanne, which was kind of like their all seasons um seasons and uh, <clears throat> i don't know all occasions um collection of 50 piece of cardstock so it was a really good price i'll i have another one i'll show you at the end okay so i also got some ghost town this is a collection called ghost town and since halloween is coming up these are the doodle pops from that collection for 150 so cute i love this little green cake um, and so on. This I picked up the icon stickers from Ghost Town. I picked up, I think, at the last Brutus Monroe sale. So that I already have. And these are the couple of piece of paper I was able to pick up from that collection this time. And again, their Halloween collection is very similar. So you can totally use them interchangeably or even with something else i think bella boulevard which is their sister company has a um halloween collection that's the same very similar in terms of color um and then i think i picked up or did i nope that's something else okay so then the next thing I picked up was some Shape Sprinkle and Doodle Pops from a collection called Land That I Love. I think this was their July 4th collection uh, from 2020. thought they're so, so cute. And then I was able to also pick up the mini icons. Now, there, there are stickers that are mini icons come in these five and a half by eight and a half sheet, and they come to you know, two sheet per whatever for the for the package. And it's normally $6. I got that for um, basically $4. So 75%, I mean, 25% off. And they're so cute. It works with all of, I seen a, a couple of there. I kind of went back and look for um, collection that they introduced in the past in terms of these and all their coloring are very similar. It even goes with the barbecue collection too. So that's the, the two sheet one, normally that price. And then I got these paper from them. And so cute, right? Land that I love with all this ice cream. 
and the hearts tone on tone some stars in different colors and hot air balloon some other bigger stars in the this is the color scheme of the collection and these okay this is a different collection but you see how similar they are i'm almost identical right i think the blue the light blue is a little bit different but no big deal right this is actually called patriotic picnic and yankee doodles now this i may have gotten from the seasonal uh, paper package from joanne but i figure i'll just show it to you since it's here so yeah in the Durant, joanne package they give you a couple of these too okay so that was my patriotic stuff then i have a whole bunch of stuff from fairy garden i i've seen this around and i loved it i just didn't want to get it when it was expensive so this was a dollar you know the shape sprinkle and the doodle pops from the entire collection that i can find including this one too yeah and this one i forgot that i got one from the doodle pop mystery box and i have two of those anyway and then i got the um they did not have the um the what do you call it the uh, <clears throat> uh bits and pieces but they did have the chit chat so i picked those up these are what it looks like lots of different cute sentiment all in the right color scheme so it should be super simple not simple but faster for you to put together your scrapbook page or card or paper craft project or whatever i love that this is the second page of that chit chat um collection now chit chat is a little bit um their chit chat has a lot of pieces as you can see here so they're priced between eight to nine dollars and i got this for six dollars okay which was awesome and then um they also had one that i'm not sure what this is it's kind of i bought it but uh, no, i'm not so sure it's say it's have um mix and match floral pieces and it's kind of i guess they they already die cut out you have the reverse two different color and you can use dimensional dot to make i guess dimensional flowers or something i actually don't know and i'm a little bit disappointed because the price was, I think it was $6. So with the discount, it's four, but you only got three sheets of each, three sheets. So, cause you know, you can't use, you can only use one side. So it was, seems like a little bit higher in price for me. That's just the chit chat um, thingy, which have 93 pieces in that. Okay, see $8, it so went down to $6. And I was also able to pick up the, um, mini the sticker sheets for the mini icon which is this normally these are um six dollars i got it for four from brutus monroe and then i also got the really cute um the regular icon which is as you can see is a little bit bigger in size so any type of thing you can do you want you need it for these are like six by twelve um sheets and these are five dollars or four dollars normally so i got it for three dollars and then i also picked up most i think i got either all of it or maybe i'm missing one piece of paper from the collection from the fairy garden collection and some of them that i know i wanted both sides i picked up two pieces so like this one i love the the little mushroom thingy but i also love this side so i went ahead and pick up two pieces of paper for that i'm gonna zoom in a little bit for that since it gotten shorter <laughs> there you go sorry Stop swinging the chandelier. I love that song, Chandelier by Sia. Um, okay, so then this one, I think I got two as well because I definitely want to cut this apart and I like this plaid in the back. This I'm sure I got two as well because these, after you cut them up, you got to be able to get the other side too and these are super cute little stars and circles and so on. These 
This one, I only got one side. I didn't care for this one too, too much. And this paper, I love this side. And then the borders, the strip borders. Actually, I should have gotten two on this one. I like the little buggy. And this one, I love this side. And this side was kind of eh, so I got one of those. I should have just gotten two of everything, but they are normally a dollar, so it was 75 cents. So it's still not cheap, so I didn't want to kill myself. I already spent, oh, a lot, <laughs> $400 <laughs> with this with this haul and the one, the part one. So I didn't want to even go more. So this was... Um, um, the, uh, you know, the cut apart, or what do you call it, the uh, sticker sheet that comes with the collection. So that was that. Then, oh, oopsie. Okay. Then I also got the, um, the, the one from Barbecue, which I think it's just adorable. We do a lot of barbecues with friends and things like that. So I thought this would be great to have. I also got the, um, what do you call it? The uh, mini sti mini icon stickers for these. I think that you already know the price by now, so I won't keep mentioning it. But 25% is 25%, right? For these kind of things that you don't normally get um, discount on. So I was grateful for that. I love it. Look at my, my husband is a chef in the family. I don't know how to cook at all. So... It's, I thought this was so cute because he has an apron, not red, but he has an apron just like that. Look at these cute little fried chicken bucket. <laughs> so sweet. And then I was able to pick up quite a few of the paper, but not the whole thing. They didn't have as much as the fairy garden one. So I got this border stripped. And look at all these ants in the back. These cute little picnic icon paper and then the back was just grass this one right here and the back is this I only picked up one of these sheets because I think I have other things in the back that I could use this one is fried chicken and corn corn my favorite corn's not good for me and uh, for probably most people but I love it so much this is some lemonade just some white stripes and then this one I got too because I definitely want to cut these apart on the back is look how cute these multi-color polka dots are right so I got those totally so happy and um, then I was able to get the, um, the chit chat with this collection as well that's what you get you get um, 85 pieces and again this is normally eight dollars i got it for six dollars which was great i laid it out for you to see lots of different sentiment appropriate sentiment and their color scheme so that was nice this is the second page of the chit chat these titles here it's a bit bigger so you can use it as the title for your page well, whatever. There's that. And then I was also able to pick up the um, Odds and Ends, which is their, um, the one that's a lot more images. And I couldn't fit all of them onto two sheets because this one came with uh, 119. That's a lot of, uh, of uh, little images, but I they're so cute, right? A little picnic table, some ice cream, even a little barbecue, and so on. And this is the two um, thing that came with the uh, odds and ends for this collection. Barbecue, cute, barbecue, so cute. Look at all these soft drinks, bottle pops. So love it. Love, love, love. Right? Even some, um, as you see, the, this barbecue is very patriotic color. So again, super simple to work it in with your any patriotic 
thingy. Okay, so that was that. Then I um I picked up this from Joanne a while back, these odd and ends on down on the farm. I don't do any farming or <laughs> visit any farms or anything like that, but I just love a lot of these animals. So I went ahead and picked it up. But then when Craft Direct had this on sale for $4, I figure I'm just going to pick it up. I, I don't know that I will actually pick up the big collection, but I just thought the, I just wanted to get the small paper pad. So again, these are 12 design double-sided and you get um, two sheet each. See, so these guys, their paper pad don't fall apart like Echo Park does. Which, and Simple Story too. So you guys, Echo Park, Simple Stories, please call Doodlebug and ask them what kind of glue they use, who their manufacturers are, so you guys can do the same because we don't like it when our stuff fall apart. Get this cute little jean pocket. Some honeycomb. Cute little tag. Get these uh, little cute little horsey. Horsey, horsey. Look at the counting the sheep. Isn't that so sweet? Oh my gosh. So cute. Oh, I got two of them in the row. Weird. All right. And I think that started at the beginning. Yep. There you go. So I got one of those to go with this. And then I uh, picked up this also, Party Time, the collection called Bar Party Time from Craft Direct. Again, I don't, ha I don't have anything from that collection. So I went ahead and picked that up and I, I liked it. I'm not, not sure if I liked it enough to buy the full collection, but it's, it's a uh, boy kind of, um, uh, whatchamacallit, um, <clears throat> birthday collection. So the colors are very easy to use. Again, you don't have to use it for, a, a, you know, a young boy. You can use some of the thing that's super birthday related to make maybe make a card for a youngster in your life. But since my kids are older, actually, I have I still have tons of stuff. I need to um, scrapbook when my my boy, my son is young, too. So it doesn't matter. But again, some of these you don't have to use it per se for a birthday but they did have look at this cute little doggy they did have some doggy pick um stuff in it so i went ahead and picked it up they say happy birthday in multicolor. um you see this little yappy birthday to you oh yeah sure very very sweet some cupcakes and i think does that start at the beginning yep there you go so um also, this is from Craft Direct. This Joanne had these on sale. Uh, normally, these petite print, which is just the the um, uh, petite print. What do you call it? Paper cardstock, basically solid cardstock that goes with their party time collection. But as you know, these colors go with many of their collection. So while it was on sale, normally these paper packs are um, the twelve sheet one are thirteen dollars. I got it from Joanne. They had it on discount. Then I had a twenty five percent coupon off my entire order. So this came out to seven seventy five. And um, so I picked. I've been trying to collect a bunch more of these cardstock. They have either the texture card stock or the petite print card stock which allows me to you know you need some solid type or a tone on tone type paper so these on one side is like the the darker you know the white dots polka dots on let's say orange and on this side is the orange polka dots mini dots on white paper so it's just the reverse and um, I know it's not very very it's kind of hard to see but um so these will make will work with a lot of different collections so when it whenever it's on sale i try to pick it up and then this is sort of weird it's it's this and then on the back it's striped so sometimes it's striped and sometimes it's the reverse polka dot so this is the stripes i sort of separate it stripes with um with the polka dot back so that way you can tell so the front is always polka dot this is tone on tone versus the first six sheets are more you know, white or or 
um, white polka dots on the darker color and then you have these horizontal stripes then you have some so they have the polka dots then they have horizontal stripes then they also have kind of horizontal gingham and in the back it's almost like a linen like stripe so again as you can tell all of these are pretty much um almost like solid color cardstock because a lot of it is tone on tone and then on the texture cardstock which i have not gotten any um they're just textures so it's even more solid color so i thought those were great to get for 775 um and that one i got from joanne okay then i had picked up this from joanne a while back which is the love note collection which i've, I've flipped through before but because I saw that they had the Love Note Petit Print Pack, I went ahead on sale. I went ahead and picked that up as well. So very similar to what I just showed you before, but different color scheme. Got this beautiful teal color. And they had these um, sort of hotter pink or darker pink polka dots. Have the gray. This gray is lighter than the gray that was in the Party Time collection. So now I have like a lot of different colors to go with any of the Doodlebug collection, which I'm so happy. So I don't have, I have not yet compiled many of the cardstock thing yet, but I, I'm planning to pick them up as um, good deals come around. Okay, those are really light gray. Um, accent it's got some floral so not all of them is the same you know there are some floral some stripes some um gingham that type of thing okay so you have a variety to work with so that was that then i got the um oh that one i'm going to show last i think okay so that so then i got these <clears throat> These also from Joanne, and they had these essential kits. I don't know if you've, I was very confused when I first started looking into these because it's kind of like a few pieces of paper. They give you, I think, six pieces of paper from the collection. So not the whole 12 piece, 12 design, but they give you some a, a doodle pop, some brat, some sprinkle, and some stickers and some alphabet. So it's kind of a neat way to start going, to get going or whatever, just to see if you like it. And these are typically, they're not cheap. I don't know why it's so expensive, but um, <clears throat> they're $20 list price. Um, I got, I was able to get it from um, Joanne with my 30% um, discount and it was already on sale. I think they had it on sale for um, $13.99 or something like that from 20 and I got it for $10.50 for this. So it's like half price. So I thought that was a super deal. And so you can see, just like um, just like what I show what I show in the sheet, you get these cute doodle pop sprinkle and these chunky brads. Yeah. And you got the um, first of all the um, the alphabet stickers in the color of the collection, different kind. And then you get the icon sticker. These are the regular size icon stickers, not the mini. So you only get the one side, yeah, which was great. And then these are the six piece of paper that you get with it. Very, very cute. And that's the back. This is the border strip one. I really like this collection now that I've seen this. So I probably will pick up the actual collection itself, the collection paper pack, because as you can see, I typically need two of these anyway. So some of these, and I definitely I don't know about that one, but um, so some of these I could use two piece, not every single paper, but um, many of them, I would need two pieces of paper anyway. So like, I like this side and I also like this side. So I, you know, so picking up the collection would be probably not a bad thing and this one i don't know what you call these thingy these funny they look like guitar pick but i guess they're like compass of some sort this is the stripes and then this one i if i didn't mention it is called i heart travel 
which is so cute. Yes, I do. Well, I like I like to travel if I can bring my dogs with me. And then this one is sort of all journaling cards. And the back is all these cute little um, luggage. So see, that one I need two too. And then Craft Direct also had it on sale um, for $4 from 7 from the 6x6 six six paper pad. So I went ahead and picked that up. As you can see, that's the one we just saw in the bigger size. Okay, with the forks in the back. This we didn't get. This have little tiny hearts on it. And in the back, look how cute that is. So we didn't get this paper. Sort of all the cancel stamp. We didn't get this paper. Yeah, I definitely need that whole collection pack. And this is just cute little um, postcards. We didn't get this sheet. Yep, yeah, got all the stamps in the back. Super cute. Then we got this sheet in the larger one in the essential kit. We got this sheet in the border strip. We didn't get this one, which is the bunch of uh, taxis or cars. And that's the side. We didn't get the cruising one. And we got this one with all the cameras. And we didn't get the, oh yeah, we got this one with the weird guitar pick thingy. And the globe one we didn't get. This got all the flags of the, of the world in the back. And then we got this paper. So you go and then it start again. So, yep, I already made up my mind to get the collection whenever it's on sale. Okay. Um, okay, so then I also got from Joanne for $10.50 by the time I get all my pricing and discount and sale price they have, the School Days collection one, the Essential Kit. And just like the other one, they come with some few embellishments, some stickers, and six pieces of paper. So I want, wanted to show you that. The, these are the, oops. These are the, um, we've got the doodle pop with the school bus, some ribbon, and some, this time, some really cute mini brats. And then you got this cute, um, whatchamacallit, regular icon stickers that are school related. So cute. <laughs> I love their faces. Actually, these are easy, not too hard for you to reproduce. You know, if you want to add any of these kind of faces on their, on your stuff, on your, on any of your own creation or your own stickers or anything like that, they're not too hard to draw in. So these are um, the alphabets that comes with the essential kit. And then these are the paper. They got some crayons and all different color and these three by four cut apart. Very cute. Some rulers. And then paint time splashing everywhere. We said some apple for the teacher and some cute polka dots red on red. Got some plaid. And then the, the star, blue stars tone on tone and some some math equation and some multicolor polka dots and multicolor stripes and then some gingham in yellow and then I wanted to show you the um, six by six paper pad that I pick up in the same collection from craft directs um, and so we didn't get this sheet in the back it's just some line notes paper we got this one we just saw that we didn't get this one which is like all science experiment and so on in the back it's all stars with faces we didn't get this one learning how to write <laughs> how to print correctly and in the back of that one is all these border strips so again i love this i will probably pick up this collection as well then you get all these school bus we didn't get that and in the back it's all these tiny little alphabets we got this one and we didn't get this one this is music classes with all the instrument and in the back it's just music notes gray on black we got the math one and we got the apple for the teacher one and we got the crayon one and we got this one too and then we did not get this one which is alphabets in a lot of different colors and then the back it's a pretty teal check paper 
And I think that was it. It started at the beginning again. So I got quite a, a big dent into my doodle bug craze, huh? So I did pick up this um, odd and ends at the zoo from Joanne when they had it on sale. And I also had a additional discount coupon on it. This was in my doodle doodle pop mystery box I also picked up from Joanne. So I already had these and I liked them. So I went ahead and picked up the collection from Joanne. They had it on sale for um normally these are $17 and I think they had it on sales for like 12 something and so by the time I had my 30% coupon on that it was I paid $9.50 for it so pretty good right you like my strategy so far okay so these are all the paper this look this look like more like giraffe print than leopard but I guess it is and you got all these cute little animals in the back I love these signs, this little thing that you can cut out and use. And then polka dots in the back. These are some cute 4 by 6 cut apart. All stuff at the zoo. And look at those cute monkeys swinging on the tree. There's 10 little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Da, da 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 mommy go to the doctor and doctor say no more monkey jumping on the bed. <laughs> I used to know those by heart. Not anymore. Okay, these cute little um, animals kind of in their little container section at the zoo. And this one is just a cute picture overall. And you had these tone on tone, a little bit tough to see, but they're um, animal doodles. And then these kind of, I don't know what they're called, but almost African print design thingy. A bunch of summer palm leaves and so on. And look at these cute pandas. Yeah. And then some border strips for all zoo related. And then some polka dots. You see, they, they rotate through their collection very similarly. They got dots, they got striped, they got gingham, they got plaid. So it's, it's good and predictable, but they are still so cute. These look like alligator, or, you know, thingy that goes with these alligator and turtles. And then you got these four by four cut apart, but it, go, it has some other strips in it. So kind of miscellaneous and some cute little words and titles there. And in the back, there's some cute elephants. So pretty. And some cute giraffes. I love the giraffe. They look so awkward, but they're so cute. And oh, my prime order is at the door. I can see their truck from my craft room. I got some a few things coming. Okay, so here's is their sticker sheets. Ooh, FedEx is here too. I think I'm I'm getting something from FedEx as well. I'm buying so many things. Okay, and then they also had, Joanne also had the um, petite print from the same collection on sale. So I got these, as you I mentioned, for $7.75 instead of um, $20 or whatever it is. Let me see, petite print, $13 instead of, yeah, so basically it's about half off. So I got the orange. Oh, I got two of these. Interesting. Oh, I got two of, of everything here. So I guess some of them is different. So that one you get two. This one you also get two. So some of them you get fewer design because you get two and you still only get 12. So this one, get the blue. So, so far that's eight. And here's 10. You get the same one. That's the back. And here's the 12. See, yeah, so you only get six design instead of, that's okay. It's actually probably good to do that anyway. Okay, so that was at the zoo. And then, um, oh, before I show you that one, oh no, I forgot to show you the Fairy Garden 6x6 paper pad. Not that, we, we did look at these already in the large one. I think I got most of them, so... Therefore, probably not necessary. I think this was the one I missed from the collection. I had, I think I had one piece of paper that I didn't have. Look how cute these bugs are. So 
Now just a quick look so you can see the whole collection. If I'm too fast, you can also always slow it down. I think I, I know how to do that on my phone. I don't know how to do that on my iPad yet. And then Joanne had these on sale as well. So I picked up, I don't even know if you know that they have these. Doodlebug, has, I've never seen it before until recently. So these are stickers for their alphas and they were $5. So I got them for, let me see, 30%. Um, it was cheap because it was, I think I paid two fifty dollars or something like that for this because it was on sale plus I get the 30% coupon. So these are just alphabets both in um, higher and lower case. You also get numbers and you get, it's a it's a full alphabet so it's two-sided. Okay, so they had, they had pink. I, I only saw these two at Joanne but I'm sure they have all different colors. So my goal is to try to pick these up as I see them on sale. So then I got um, the last couple of Joanne hauls ago or maybe the last one I picked up one that says seasons and you get one piece of paper for all of basically all of these that you see here I flipped I did a flip through on that and it was um Joanne had it on on their list price was $28 um I don't know if that's the right price I didn't find actually I forgot to write it down I will write it down um, later on because I forgot to look it up um, but I think it wasn't too far off but anyway I used my 50% coupon on this and so it was only see here it's say $25 so Joanne mark it up to 28 but I did use my 50% coupon so I paid $14 for this one um, so I order I went to order um, another one that's called seasons but it, the pictures on here was different than this and they mailed me the exact same one again so I called them and they actually replace me with this one. This is the only other <coughs> one that they have, which I also wanted. Again, it's $25 and I pay $14. And when they replace it, they didn't even bother. They didn't ch charge me shipping or anything, uh, which I never pay shipping because you know, Joanne get free shipping if you your order is $50. And um, they just charged me $14, no tax, nothing. So that was awesome. So that's this is what you get, all the paper. But I'm gonna do a flip through for you. I love this collection. I actually, I'm going to buy the whole collection because it's puppies. I can't help my shelf. These are cute paw prints, tone on tone. Look how cute that is. So they give you a few pieces of paper from each collection, seems like. And then they usually give all oh, the Canine Chronicles. Cute. Um, and then they typically give you... Like this is also puppy love. I'm glad because even if I buy the whole collection, I won't have, I will still want this paper. I want both sides, you know? So no worries on that. And then they usually give you some kind of um, specialty in this pack, this type of pack, some specialty paper that kind of go with the, with the one that they put. So usually they put a few pieces of paper from a collection and then they put um, some paper, a specialty paper that goes with that collection in the back. So these are the two they put in. Gorgeous. Glitter paper. Uh, very pretty. And then they have the um, Kitten Smitten collection too, which I also love. I don't, I don't have cats, but these cats are just so cute. Look at those sweet faces and the color is so pretty. I mean, you can use this for girls layout. Doesn't have to be about cats at all. You know, hearts, very generic. But these are also kitten smitten still. And then these are some cats doodle tone on tone in gray. And then they gave you these specialty card stock that goes with it and this and so on so then now you move to a sugar and spice collection which i really like this collection so i may need to look into that it's a slightly older collection i think so um yeah it's like 2012 so i haven't been able to find too many things on from it but look how pretty this glitter it has some of the circle has glitter on it some of it don't and this is the back so cute this is also sugar and spice and this is about a it's a kind of like a, a girl collection i guess a baby girl collection and a 
again, such pretty colors that you can use for anything per se. It doesn't have to be. That's why I like these, these kind of um, collection pack or, you know, paper pack because they, they come with a few things. So you can kind of see it for yourself, see if you like the collection, but also you can use them for whatever. Yeah, so in this particular pack, they give, they give you a bunch of these glitter kind of floral um, like thing. I don't even know where you would buy this per se. It's called Cupcake Daydream Cardstock. And then this Daily Doodle. This I've seen here and there. I don't know where you get it from per se. I don't, I've never seen a pack on that. And this one is the Hey Cupcake Collection. And this is all kind of girl birthday, the girl birthday collection. And the back is all a bunch of candies. This actually kind of can go with Halloween too. Look at the lime green color. And then this is all balloons, such pretty colors. And that's the back. And then the specialty paper on this is kind of a hot pink. The same glitter paper, glitter floral paper. And now we have Under the Sea. But you see how these two collections, like, so similar in colors. You can totally use them interchangeably if you like. So Under the Sea, these are some cute two-by-twos. And some leaves. Got some mermaids going on here. Super cute. Also from Under the Sea. And now those leaves are in the tone on tone. And then they gave you this specialty glitter polka dots paper. Specialty paper. Then you have fairy tales. These are all girl collection. I sort of grouped them together so easy for you to follow. And tone on tone polka dots. So also fairy tale again. Is that the same paper? No. Different paper, very similar. Very cute. And then the back is a cut apart. All right, these are what it said here at the, those thingy. These are some cute hearts paper. And then tone on tone hearts in the back. And look at how beautiful this purple glitter paper is. That's my daughter's favorite color. Okay, so now I flip over to um, baby, I mean boy thing, and this is a baby boy called Special Delivery. The back is some fork and spoon. Yeah, and then this is the special they, they gave with this collection. Um, the glitter floral paper again in that same collection now this is party time which i have remember i have a few uh, i have the petite print cardstock with that so and something else and so this is actually the collection some of the paper from the collection so that's cool some journaling bits and it's the stripes in the back oops and some party hats and then these are kind of stars and triangle and stuff, tone on tone. And what they gave with that is this floral glitter stock. And then Dragon Tails, again, very similar color to Party Time. And it's also a um, boy, boy birthday boy collection. So super easy to use together, you see? So I love it. The back of that is this horizontal stripes. Then you have Anchors of Weight, which is the opposite, the boy part of Under the Sea. Okay, same coloring as the two collection we just looked at. Anchors of Weight again. It's all the creatures underneath the sea. And then some bubbles. Some bubbles. And this is the specialty they gave with that. This would go perfect with Fairy Garden. So you can... You can move stuff around, do different things that you like. You don't have to keep it the way they sent it, but that's how they sent it, okay? And then this is um, the Hello collection. Now, I have a lot of Hello. I, ha I bought all their chit-chat and, and odds and ends before. I love this collection, so I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to get the collection. Afterward, these are horizontal, I mean, um, um, diagonal stripes. Yeah, this is a, a 
much stronger collection color wise with bold uh, blue kind of like a royal blue this is all foil horizontal stripe and there's some cute bows and this is what they give you some like kind of like light orange color thingy and then they have one that's called sweet summer see this goes well with sweet summer too look this or this yeah sweet summer is so cute all these fruits i don't know if you saw my hobby lobby haul uh, that i posted yesterday i had a bunch of fruit that from this felt fabric uh, piece that i was able to buy get from hobby lobby for like 20 cents or something like that and it was so cute this is a collection i actually love and i probably will try to pick up the whole collection when i can find it it's called so much pun like so much fun you know and it's just so cute i don't know what it's about it seems like it has some animals some junk food i don't know and they even have some uh, you know when you get an owie i don't know why that would be so much fun but anyway and some pills you gotta pop some pills to have some fun hmm interesting and then you got some of these dinosaurs and some palm trees and then this was school days. So we just had, I, you just saw the essential kit from school days. I have this in the collection. So, but remember, I want both sides. So now I got two. And then I didn't have this school bus one because remember we saw the other one in there, but now I do from this collection, I think. And then they had a very pretty um, vellum paper that's all stars and the stars are embossed it's kind of stick up it's almost like feel like glossy accent gorgeous and then this is the specialty paper you get it's the similar floor glitter card stock and then these things were out of nowhere but it will go with very well with ghost town or any of their halloween collection there's just black um white polka dot on black and this black glitter floral paper now my whole thing is glitter up so anyway i have a few more things from the brutus monroe collection but i'm gonna save it and show it um a little bit later with a happy mail that i'm getting from one of my really good youtube friends karen so i will show you that in a little while but in any case i bid you farewell for now and until next time you go keep crafting Keep hunting for great deals and I will see you real soon. Bye.